Hey guys, well it's uh, it's Dad and, and Caleb out on a uh, little coyote hunt up in the uh, in the uh, San Bernardino National Forest up near Lake Arrowhead on some recommended property, and we just got set up. It's late in the afternoon; it's about 4:30, and so we got everything set up, and our electronic coyote caller ought to start here in about two minutes. And so uh, we're in an old burnt over area, uh, about six miles up in the. Uh, northeast of Lake Arrowhead, and so um, we'll see what happens. Yep. You excited? Yes, sir. All right. All right. Catch you in a little bit. So this is our first setup. We didn't have any luck, so we're gonna go try somewhere else, and hopefully we'll have something on the ground by that time. So let's just pray that we get something on the ground before we head out. Okay, so we've been uh, setting for about an hour. <coughs> really no luck. So uh, we did our first calling sequence, and now we're going to head out to our, our second calling sequence, which is just over this next ridge in front of us. We've got the wind in our face, but that's really good. And so uh, we're going to make a little trip. Well, we're on our second set of the morning. It's probably about uh, 9 30, 10 o'clock by now. And we uh, haven't any luck, but we've had a lot of fun. So, just beautiful country. And uh, uh, the light breeze. And Caleb's, Caleb keeps telling me there's quite a few bugs. So, quite a few flies, but it, it's not too bad. Uh, but that light breeze got to keep them all above us. Uh, just really haven't seen anything. But still a great day. Hi guys, it's great to have you back with us. Hey, well you know that we've been on this little coyote hunt for the last couple of days, Caleb and I have, and and we've been telling you we're up in San Bernardino National Forest and uh, we just happened to come up on uh, a big flat that I had seen on an aerial photo that looked like it had an old dirt runway on it. Sure enough, it's a full-blown runway and right up here on the top of the San Bernardino National Forest up several miles north of Lake Arrowhead uh, is a dirt runway that was put in about 10 years ago uh, we actually got to meet the guy who owns it. Mark is a great guy, and he's actually going to let Caleb and I camp here uh, tonight. And so we're here at uh, the first ever Lake Arrowhead uh, dirt runway and airport. And so it's, I think it's on the website as Lake Arrowhead uh, Airport. And um, I'm looking forward to getting back and seeing their website and seeing all about it. But Mark has been so kind to us. He's said, yeah, just enjoy yourself. And and uh, spend time. It's a 150 acre private ranch and uh, dirt strip so uh, he allows people to fly in and camp here and so um, Caleb what do you think about that? It's pretty awesome. Pretty awesome. Mark's a good dude huh? Yes sir. Yep so um, uh, we're gonna hang out here the the afternoon uh, probably take a little nap have a little lunch and um, then late this afternoon head back off of this property back into the National Forest for a little coyote hunting late this afternoon. So I just wanted to give you that little update and show you a little bit about the, uh, the airport. So uh, we'll catch you later.
Okay, Caleb just called me and he says he thinks he found a rattlesnake. So. Uh, they stay for about a year and then they just take off. He's a good one. Not a big one, but he's a good one. Right there. Man, I'm afraid of mama that's just sitting there. All right, Caleb. All right. Ooh, grab him, Caleb. Caleb's going to hold him right there at a safe distance from Daddy. <laughs> and we're going to we're going to get you in here close. Watch this. We're going to put all of our buddy in close. Sit right there, Caleb. Right. Okay, folks, we're going to bring you in for a close one. And don't worry, Caleb, stay that distance. I'm about, folks, just so you know, I'm about four foot away. <laughs> Caleb, hold him right there. Okay. Awesome. Caleb found a rattlesnake. I bet you my wife is really excited right now. Oh yeah, really excited. But Caleb's snake tongs are about 42 inches long. And then I've got this camera on a tripod, so we're good to go there. Awesome. What do you think about that, Caleb? Awesome. First rattlesnake live to catch. That's great. This is, this, we got we're going to have to put this on, on YouTube, man. All right. Um, do you have a cup so we can put him in like a, um... No, we're going to let him go. No, but I want to grab him behind the head. No. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> no, sir. <laughs> I'm doing good to let you pick up a poison snake. All right. Here I am with my new Rossi 410 single shot. And, um, I want to shoot some clay birds and see what I can do. See if I can blow some up. All right? Oh, that's a good try. Let's do it again. Shot right under it, I think. I saw the wadding. Get set, get ready. Get, get a good stamp. Pull. Oh, ho, 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 ho. way to go, dude. <laughs> get good and, get good and ready. Get it in your shoulder. Point it this way right here. Come in. Pull. Good try. Put it, remember, put it right on it. Pull. <laughs> Dusted it, baby. That's awesome. Yeah. Just put it to dust, man. That's great shooting. Hey, gang, wasn't that awesome? It is so good to see Caleb shooting this 410. First time we've had it out. So proud of you, buddy. Way to go. Making dust out of clay pigeons. That's awesome. Now we've seen the horses again. What else do we see? Saw some deer. Deer. And some ducks. Ducks. Yeah, yep. so we see a lot today, huh? Yep. Rattlesnakes, deer, ducks, deer, ducks, horses. Horses. No coyotes. Nope. 
Good time? Yes, sir. Awesome. Almost time to go grab some some nap, nap time. So it has been um, a little... Oh, look at there. That's much better. So it has been a great day with Caleb, and uh, he got to catch his first uh, rattlesnake with his snake tongs, and then we've seen ducks and deer and horses. I got a horse right now who is right there, aren't you, buddy? And um, this is a great time. Great memories made today. Um, there's always great memories when you're out in the uh, outdoors with your kids. And so it was great memories for Caleb and I today. I know that, that I'll always remember him catching his first rattlesnake and uh, spending time up here on the mountain with dad. So just a great, great, great time.